Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of 12 Minutes. Now, in the last episode, I played the game for almost three hours, and I only got one ending. Can you all believe that? Three hours of a game called 12 Minutes, and I only got one ending. So a lot of people were telling me in the comments that the ending that I got wasn't really even a real ending. There's actually a few more endings that we actually have to get. So I got a few tips in the comments. Our wifey is coming out to give us a big sloppy kiss right now, right? Yeah? You gonna do it? You gonna give us the yeah? All right, you guys cool with that? You down with that? Everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go. So what you guys told me to do is right off the bat tell her that the day is restarting, so she's getting caught up in this whole loop stuff. I'm the same evening over and over. Mm, been there. No, no, no. For real though, tell her what happened the night she ran away. Explain in more detail. I haven't figured out how it all works yet, but I always end up back at the start of the night, and no matter what I do. Well, that sounds terrible. Yeah, but yeah, hear me out. Is. There's more. Can I, I need to tell you. Somehow? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, she actually never said that before. She never offered her help. Let's tell her what happened the night she ran away. Look how your father died. It's not what you think. I know how he really died. What are you doing? It yeah, you dugged him, and then somebody else dugged him in the future. Eve. He caught you sneaking out. So you caught him with a bullet right in the heart. I couldn't. You told me in a previous loop. I did what? Listen, listen, he didn't die when you shot him. What are you doing? He survived. Your brother, the one you always called monster. He killed him a week later. I have a fucking brother. I have you have a fucking brother? I didn't know it He's either. the one who did it. That Polaroid from the coffee shop, it proves it wasn't you. What is going on? I know. <sighs> okay, you ready? There's more. A man but is wait, there's more. The doorbell and accuse you of murder. What? He was close to your father, and when your dad died, it really messed him up. Uh, okay, okay. I'll be ready. I need to sit down. Okay, so we have to get to know her a little bit more. And um, let's see the other topics. No, now is not a good time for dessert. Are you shitting on my chest? Let's talk about the cop. And we're going to say, tell her the cops wants to watch to save his daughter. Uh -huh. He's after your father's watch. His daughter has cancer, and the watch will pay for her treatment. That's awful. I can't imagine what that's like. Okay. Uh, let's not talk about it. Let's talk about her past. Find more about the brother being the killer. Your half-brother? He's the killer. How do we find Wait, him? how do you know he's a half-brother? What if he's a step, bro? Me anything about him. I don't even know his name. Okay, what about the nanny? I was two years old. I have no idea. I mean... Cop said he knew my father, right? Right? Right. Maybe he was there back then? Maybe, baby. Let's um leave Let's the conversation for now. A lot of people were telling me in the comments that I have to look at the watch. I don't know what that much. even means, but maybe there's something that we can click on. So let me go grab the watch that she's this hiding in the vent. The first time I played this shit, okay. look, look maybe at this. You can't even see the vents. Bro, you have to know it's there unless you use the mouse and you gotta, you know. Look. Do some Wingardian Leviosa type shit and just make it float in front of you. So let's do a little bit of that. Boom, bop, pow. Get the pocket watch. And you all told I mean, me that I got to take a look at it. Whole... I'm it's taking a look at insane. it. It's a watch that doesn't look like it's worth fighting over. Definitely not killing over. All these years. Is she still I talking? Thought... I want to talk about her brother. But let's show her the watch. Here, have the watch. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, let's talk about the cop. We can't talk to the cop or talk about the cop. Should we dance with her? Nah, I do not want to have this dance. Open it, open it, open it. Come on, I truth. know you're home. Open the door. Okay, we'll tell him the truth. He opened the door for us! I'm with the police. Turn around, please. Wait, stop. I have something you need to see. What did you say? I didn't kill my father. Uh-huh. He had an affair. Stop talking. Please, will you just listen to me? No, I listen to innocent people. Let me murderers. go near the photo. Shut up. I'm innocent. That's enough. Hold still. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't do it. Hold on, look. Polaroid. Polaroid. Look. Bald man. Bald man. Cop, look. Look at this. No, no, he has to take a look. That proves you didn't do it. Wow. What am I doing wrong? Are you coming for me? He's coming for me. Get your freaking hands off me, asshole! That doesn't make any sense. Why won't the cop listen? He listened before, or does he only listen to his daughter, Bumblebee? 
which is a dumbass name, by the way. Okay, so I called Bumblebee, and now I have an option to tell her why her father is really doing listen, this. Uh, your daddy I don't think I got that us. option before, right? Steal from so, us so that he can pay for your treatment. He has to. What? No. No, we my did dad, get that before. He wouldn't do that. My wife, my wife has this I mean, expensive pocket watch, this? and your dad. Wants I hate how she keeps it. talking while someone talking else is talking. It's cold. I guess that's what I do too. Fine, huh? I will. Okay, so Bumblebee is gonna calm Baldi's nerves. So, let's uh, hmm, let's talk about the cop, and let's no, wait for him to arrive. Wait. All these. Because I don't want to waste any more time. I think once Bumblebee calls him, and then now we know I've we know about the brother, to maybe he's going to give us a little bit more information, right? So, thank you for listening. Yeah, I hear him talking outside. Okay. So, let's look at the peephole. Let's see if his demeanor changes. Carolee C, still bald and ugly as ever. Alright, he's chilling. He's, he's just chilling. Did they threaten me? Come on, man. They're always talking about threatening. They're like, hey, is that a threat? Every time you say something, is that a threat? Man, shut your dumb ass, bald ass up. I'm sorry, everybody. I just really want to get an ending. Can we show her the Polaroid? Here, you have to take the picture. I'm not going to be able to give it to you later. Oh, there you go. Okay, so we have to give her the picture, too. And then she can show bald guy. You know, even though she could just be like, hey, look on the fridge over there. There's my picture. Bada bing, bada boom. But you know, hey, video game logic, right? Should I sit on the couch, too? Should we just get prepared? Should I prepare thy butt cheeks for another letdown? I don't know, but this man stay talking. Can you just ring the doorbell already? But wait, did he leave? Wait, he left? Why the fuck did he leave? Hey, he left. What the heck? He d he didn't even come. Oh, I shouldn't have talked to Bumblebee. But that's interesting, right? That he just leaves? Okay, I guess this is not gonna work. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna yoink myself out and then the day is gonna start. So I gotta repeat that whole thing, but instead of calling Bumblebee, I'm just gonna give my wife the picture and then hopefully the cop can give us some answers about the brother. Here, I'm opening the door, bud. Come on. On the ground Wait, 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 stop. I have something you need to see. What did you say? He just walks right past me. I'm gonna stand right here. Stop talking. Please, will you just listen to me? No, I listen to innocent people, not murderers. Now shut up. That's enough. Are Hold you kidding still. me? Oh, oh, oh. What is happening, dude? Oh, no, Sir, I didn't I'm gonna stab it. this fool, bro. <laughs> no, I'm gonna stab this fool. <laughs> Fuck this. Give me my knife. Give me my knife. Stab this bitch. Okay, I think I need to get a little bit more information from the cop because now that we know what we know about our wife's brother. We got to get a little bit more information from the cop because I think he knows more than he's letting on. So we're just going to hide in here and let's see how this all plays out. I opened the front door so my man could just walk right in, not have to waste the time doing all that doorbell bullshit. And come on, fast forward the time. Now we wait. Yeah, now we wait. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay. I'm just going to lean back and just let the game do its thing. This is a freaking long ass game, by the way. I thought, you know what? 12 minutes is not going to take me that long to be. What's up, copper? Come on, cops don't really wear gloves like that, though. They don't wear OJ gloves like that, though. That shit doesn't even make any sense. But whatever. Do not close the door. Okay, thank you. So, let me grab this dude's bullshit. Thank you, table for Hamana. Should I shoot him in the leg and get some answers? I kind of want to because I'm a sick fuck. Ah, whatever. Just get in your freaking stomach, dude. Hands behind your back. Zip tie this fool. There you go. I think I should shoot him. I'm gonna shoot him, cause I want to. Shoot him in this leg. Take turns with the legs. Oh, he shoots him in the same freaking spot every time. What the fuck? You know what the fuck. You know what's up. All right, listen up. Say you are innocent. Ask him about the nanny. Let's uh, ask him about the nanny. What do you remember about the nanny from the affair? Uh, who cares about the nanny? I care about the I nanny. Do. She had a son, and he's the real murderer. What? When you found the old man, he, he wasn't dead yet. He was mumbling something. You remember what he said? How could you possibly? He said monster. Yeah, he I was supposed to go monster. back and talk to this monster guy. Monster is what his wife called the bastard child. How do you know this? It doesn't matter. What do you know about the nanny? I barely remember her. It was so long ago. Oh, come on, there's got to be something. Her name? Daphne? 
daisy, maybe. Or some sort of flower. Dahlia. Flower? That's the best you can do? It was Dahlia. Over 20 here. Dahlia is the oh, mom's name. Back. Dahlia is the, the one from the onesie that we have right here. Dahlia. Look at this. Cute onesie. So what? The name. Look at the name. Is that the nanny that he had the affair with? Oh, yes. Dahlia. That's it. Her name was Dahlia. What? No, 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 no. Please, God. Huh? Huh? Shh. She was my mother. Yeah, because when he looked at the thing, he said, that's my mother's name. So... No. No. So that's his mom. No. So his mom is the nanny. Yo, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Whoa. Uh Hey, come on. Interesting. Snap out of it. Look, I know this is a lot to drop on you. But I gotta know that we're on the same page concerning these feelings. So, consider your answer to this question very carefully. What do you want with my daughter? I can't just stop feeling for her. Wait, 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 wait. I love her with everything in me. I don't care about your feelings. Feel however you feel. Feelings don't matter. What are you going to do? What are you talking about? What are you, you going to do? Maybe she doesn't need to know. Maybe it's all her fault. Maybe she can accept the truth. Wait. So, she has a half-brother killed that wife. killed the father, mother but her half-brother's mom is the nanny, daughter. and her name is Dahlia, and his mom's name is Dahlia, God. and... Bleh. Sorry, I almost coughed Dahlia up some sweet home Alabama. Maybe she doesn't need to know. Look, you want to know my answer? Bleh. Yes, I do. Bleh. What the fuck is maybe, this? Maybe she doesn't need to know. Maybe we can just be happy. What, we just keep this from her? You expect me to stand here and say nothing while you just fucking dance around like nothing's wrong? What if she gets pregnant? You want me to just keep this secret from her, from my daughter? Hey, she's you my sister, bro. To be happy? I don't know. Sorry. People pretend oh. to be happy all the time. <laughs> Come on, you we gotta keep it in the family. Snake, if you loved her, you wouldn't lie to her. She deserves better than you. She does. You're she does. You fucking idiot. <laughs> Yeah, please Her slap some sense so into me. Naive, so stupid. Thank you. Uh, oh uh, shit! So that's no. what happened. He popped two in Pop's chest. It wasn't just one bullet. What was he doing strapped up during a conversation? Dude, what the Hey everybody? I got one question and one question only. What the fuck? What the actual mother, sister, brother, fuck? Oh, God. So what do we do now? We know what we know. Do we just talk to her and be like, hey, I'm your brother. No. I'm your brother. No. It can't fucking be. It, it is what it is, my dude. Honey, babe, are you? No, no, you, st you stay back. Hey, it's me. It's me. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> no, don't touch me. Let me help. What is it? Stay away. Talk to me. No. Whoa. Tell me what's going on. Hey. But this is disturbing. It, it can't be true. It can't be true. I hope it's not true. I actually don't want it to be true because that is ridiculous. That is so stupid. Okay, well, let's talk to our sister, wife, partner, sibling. Her. It just says her name is her. Okay, uh, let's talk about the day we're starting. the same evening over and over. Mm, been there. Tell her what happened the night she ran away. Explain in more detail. I haven't figured out how it all works yet, but... I always end up back at the start of the night, and no matter what I do. Well, that sounds terrible. Yeah, it is. C can I help somehow? I don't know. I don't know. 
Tell her what happened the night she ran away. Look how your father died. It's not what you think. I know how he really died. What are you doing? It was a heart attack. No, it wasn't. It was Christmas Eve. He caught you sneaking out, and he hit you. How could you? Know I'm not that? fast forwarding because maybe he's gonna say something new. You told me in a previous loop. I did what? Listen, listen. He didn't die when you shot him. What are you doing? He survived. Your brother, the one you always called monster. He killed him a week later. I have a fucking brother. A half brother from your father's affair. You do. He's the one who did it. That Polaroid from the I think you're taking effing brother to a whole nother level. What is going on? <laughs> you know. You know what I mean? Right, there's more. Listen, a man is about to ring the. Okay, okay, okay. But I don't care about that stuff. What? His daughter has. Uh, I don't care about that. We we know about this yeah. whole treatment stuff. I need to sit down. No, we need to talk. We need to talk to you. So talk about your past. Tell her what really happened. I don't know how to say this. I've forgotten a lot of things that I'm just remembering now. Things that if I could go back, I would have done differently. What are you talking about? Say you killed her father. Tell her you are her brother. God, what the? Yo, what no, the? It was me. I'm the man that killed your father. <laughs> what kind of sick joke? Look, his office is filled with books, all the way up to the ceiling. I never forgot how weird that looked. What? What are you? No, no. I, I can't handle this. Why? After all this time. Say it's your fault. It wasn't my fault. It's clearly your fault, brother. It's all my fault. All of it. I should have told you. God, you're my only family. I couldn't lose you. If I could go back, I'd fix this. Go back? If you could go fucking back. I'm having your child. I'm Dude, sorry. Yeah, I'm I forgot sorry. about that. That makes it better. I actually forgot she was Jesus. pregnant with our child. Say you will confess to the cop. The cop I told you about. It's gonna be here soon. He's come here before? Yes. Look, I can't undo what I've done, but I can clear your name. I can confess. Who are you? Just let me try and fix this, please. I have ruined everything. But you deserve Should I have told her that I'm the brother what first? I kind of wanted to see her reaction. No, wait. Okay, wait. There's more. Don't put hey. the tears yet. We are not talking. Come on, sister. We'll just wait for the cop to arrive. I'll tell her I'm the brother in the next loop. All right, the cop's here. We kind of just been waiting here. I was listening to her cry the whole time. I'm with the police. Turn around, please. Wait, stop. I have something you need to see. What did you say? I'm the murderer. How do I talk I to you? Know you think I killed my father? But please. It was it him. Was enough. You're under arrest. Will you? Ju you have to listen to me. How do I talk to no, him? Honey, I. Please, let me talk. No, let me talk. No, I do not. Only people I have to listen to are my daughter and my mother, and my mother's dead. Now shut up. That's enough. Hold still. Wait. Sir. I'm the guy. I'm the guy. No, it's I'm not. Excuse me, I'm the guy. Fine, I'm calling Bumblebee. Oh I'm calling Bumblebee, I'm snitching. I'm snitching. Here, I'm gonna snitch. Snitching. Oh dude, let me snitch! Let me snitch! Why will he let me snitch? Do I gotta call Bumblebee? Why am I not confessing? Bro, it doesn't take much to confess. Just say the words. Babe, now he's gonna close the. This is a misunderstanding. Before we do anything else, there's a piece of evidence I need. He's the one. He killed my. There you go. He just confessed to me. Where's the pocket watch? I know it's here. Tell him, you fucking coward. Tell him everything. No. Where's the watch, sir? Fine. How do I just tell him? Take it. It's in the bathroom then. Under the cabinet. Yes, I don't need you anymore, partner. No, please, please, come on. That's my sister. Look, I, I, I don't know. Don't Wait, what are you doing? Oh my god, how do I tell You're him it was me? Okay, so I'm gonna say that I am her brother. Nanny from your father's affair. What about her? Let's see what happened. Her name was Dahlia. She was my mother. What? Your dad found me after your mother passed. It's me. I'm your brother. What are you saying? It was you. You killed him. <coughs> and then, Sorry. Oh my God, Caught I'm up a fur ball. I, I can't handle this. Why? After all this time? Say it's your fault and you regret it. It's all my fault. I'm sorry. Baby, you were my only family and I couldn't lose you. Baby. I could go back. You just found out that was your sister still better. with the baby? I'm sorry. Jesus. You ruined. I wish I never met you. Look, I'm just your half-brother. Say you will confess to the cop. I told you about, he's gonna be here real soon. 
You don't have to believe me. It doesn't matter. Look, I can't go back to the past, but I can confess now. I can clear your name. Let me try and fix this, please. You deserve a real life. What do I even say to this? Fine. Let's wait. Okay, before we do that, I need to make a phone call to Bumblebee. Hey, what's up, Bumblebee? Hello? Hey, hey. Your dad says that my wife murdered her father. Can you help? Please, he is gonna hurt her. What are you talking about? Why would you say that? Confess you are the killer. Say your wife is innocent. I'm gonna say my wife is innocent and I'm gonna turn on the camera. What's up, everybody? My wife is innocent, but your dad, he won't listen to us. I don't know what you want. Hey, well, please, could you just call him and tell him to listen? He doesn't have the whole story. Okay, fine. I'll call him, but lose my number. Lose my number? Lose the attitude. Okay, I still have her number. Good. I didn't lose the number. Cause I don't listen to nobody. Nobody, especially if their name is freaking Bumblebee. Honey, I think you got prank called. I think you got prank <laughs> called. It's just a prank, bro. It's just a prank half, bro. Come on, come over here. Hey, what's up, my bro? Get over here. Come on, you know the vibes. Yeah, just walk on down here. Let's talk. Let's talk. Get on the ground. Wait, I don't want to talk on the ground. I have something you need to see. What did you say? I don't want to talk on the ground. I know you think I killed my father. Please, just listen to what my husband has to say. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Tell him. Do you have anything you want to tell me? Um, sure. Okay, so... So? Listen. So you didn't do anything? Ask about his daughter's illness. Tell him you killed her father. Tell him your wife is your sister. Stop it! Tell him you killed her father. Me. I'm the one that killed the old man. What? The last words he was saying before he died. Monster, monster. That's I'm me. My monster. name is Monster. That's what his wife, what her mother, called me when she found out that I existed. Jesus. You killed your father and married your sister. I, you know what I mean? It was an accident. You know what I was saying? Accidentally hooking up with my sister. What do you want me to do? It was an accident. He attacked me. An accident. Oh, I thought the Excuse incest me. was accident. My bad. Where the, you the, going? the incest you was accident. The, the killing was you. No. Shut I up. You. Oh shit! No, no. Wait. No. Hey, can I take that back? Damn. Oh, fuck you. I was supposed oh. to click the other one. My bad, everybody. Okay, so this time I'm gonna say that it's my fault. This is all on me. She didn't know. It's not her fault. I, I just told her, like, the truth a second just ago. Just totally told her the truth, like, one second ago, dude. I don't. Uh, we'll deal with that later. There's a watch. I want the watch. Do you have it? Um, I'm gonna tell him about the watch. We'll give you the watch. We won't tell anybody. No one has to die. Okay, hand it over. Well, I don't have it with me. Let me just grab it. Yeah, it'll just be... Ah, nice try. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I have to have the watch on me? What else do you want? You want me to wind it up for you? You want me to give you a couple bucks for the Uber ride back home? Son of a mother bitch! Okay, so I'm gonna tell him about the watch. Yeah. We'll give you the watch. We won't tell anybody. No one has to die. Here. Give it to him. What are you gonna ask next? A back rub? I'm going to leave now. Remember, if I found you once, I can find you again. And you don't want to see me again. Didn't we just confess to murder? Arrest me, dog. What just happened? I need to I go in front of the justice system. You need me to leave. Get out of here. Get Wait. the fuck out. Babe. You fucking monster. Babe. 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 Come on, babe. Babe. You hear me? Babe. Get out babe. of my apartment. Babe. I never want to see you babe. again. Babe. 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 All right. We got to leave. She don't want to have anything to do with us. Please. Just leave. I can't look at you anymore. There's one more thing I gotta say. Babe? Alright, alright, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. I got an, uh, an achievement, Fuck. confess. I did everything right. What else do you want? I did everything right. So what do I do now? The time is going backwards now. So I definitely did it right. Thank you all, you weren't trolling me. I thought you guys were just pulling my leg. Hey guys were throwing me for a loop. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you see what I... Let me just shut up, the time's going backwards. The time's going backwards. We all know that time doesn't do that. The only thing time knows how to do is go forward. It never goes backwards. 
So is it gonna stop eventually? Eventually type shit? Yes, no, maybe so. Oh, I like how it did that. That was smooth. We went from holding the clock to it being on the wall. And now it is... What is that? 11.50... Hey, how many? there he is. You're back. Yeah, I'm back. Look, I know this is a terrible shock, but we need to be on the same page. These feelings for my daughter... Your sister. Sicko mode. Look. I want to be with her. Maybe it's better that we aren't this together. Isn't yeah. This how I want to tell you. You think? <sighs> aren't there laws? All right. All right. Uh, yeah, I guess. I guess there is a world where I leave and where she doesn't get to know why. There is. And I know. I know it's hard. Thank it's you hard, for all right. understanding why it needs to be this way. This whole... Ah, I've made so many mistakes. But for what it's worth, I'm glad you turned out so well. Until I shoot you. Yeah, let's hug it out. Let's hug it out. There, there. Alone. Okay. So we got the alone achievement. This is a very creative game. God damn. Amazing. Amazon. I actually really enjoyed this. I know that, you know, there's been moments where I'm like, ah, oh, come on, what am I doing? That's because I didn't know what I was doing. But once you finally get endings, you know, endings for your endings, endings on top of endings, it's like an ending cake. It's just so many flavors all up in your mouth, all up in your throat. Then it feels good. That's when it feels really good. And this voice acting for this game has like an all-star cast. James McAvoy, Daisy Ridley, and um, William Dafoe. Got the Green Goblin over here. Music by Neil Bones. My guy's name is Neil Bones? That is a dope-ass name. There's a lot of testosterone in that name. Neil Bones. Neil Bones Jones. Yeah, Neil Bones, your wife. That's a great name. So is Boel Oyino. She sounds like a spell. Louis Mello. Nah, that's all right. And you, you can't follow Neil Bones. That's tough. Louis Antonio. Story by Louis Antonio. He's the one who wrote about the half brother. Because the story was by him. Yo, Louis, you sick, bro. You sick. You sick for that one. Half bro, half sis. That's his wife, man. He got her pregnant. Come on, dog. But here we go. The clock has struck 12. What? Oh, that was it? Oh. Oh, this is spicy. This is spicy like a meatball. Whoa. This is different. I remember in the beginning of the game, there were some ugly ass paintings I could look at. And then there was a door on the left that had an annoying ass baby and a door on the right that I couldn't unlock. It's locked. I have a key though. So I never lost my key. Cause it was under a fake rock. And we don't fuck with fake rocks. We don't like fakes. Oh, dang. So this basically says that my sister was the one who designed the whole apartment. She was the one with the taste. Nobody's here? Cause there's nothing in here. Is there even a toilet? There is. Okay, ventilation grid. Can't open that with just my hands. Can't well, too bad I don't even hands. have a knife. I don't have shit. Anything in here? Bro, I don't even have a bed? This is ridiculous. Now this is getting goddamn ridiculous. Anything in here? Well, there's not even a closet, just a black hole. There's nothing here. No, don't hide in there. Get out. Okay. I'm guessing that, uh... No power. No power. Bro, I have no furniture, no wife, no power. Man, if that's how it's gonna be, you might as well be with your sister. Shit. Can I leave? That's crazy. So that's the ending that I live in. This is freaking random. I wonder if it's gonna be like this forever. Don't tell me. 
If that's gonna, if that's how it's gonna be forever, there's gonna be a dope ass ending. Wow. So that's it. That's the real ending. I'm alone. Wow. Okay, so this is the actual reality that we're in. We never did anything with the sister. So that means none of this shit ever happened. Okay. That is interesting. So there you guys go. That is the true ending of 12 minutes. We end up alone. We never pursued our sister, so she never became our wife. We never ended up killing the father, and this shit is crazy. Okay, so I've kind of just been sitting here for a few minutes now, just wondering what I just played, and I feel like video games that do that are so good. I don't care if you agree whether the story is great or not. The ones that make you think, it's just like any movie or a book. That might be the author's intentions is to make you think it doesn't matter how it made you feel as long as it made you think about it and process it in the way that you want to process it i think that's what makes something good in my opinion because something being good is all subjective it's not objective like subjective means that it's our opinion objective means that it's just straight stone cold facts and you can't deny it so you know something being good is subjective and i think the author wanted us to just think about what the hell just happened here so the true ending i guess was the one that i just got right now because the game repeats like i can't do anything i just keep going back out of the elevator in my lonely ass apartment don't have a wife don't have a pregnant wife don't have a soon-to-be child don't have murder on my hands none of that stuff so the true ending is that all of those things that we just went through didn't happen some people might say that's a big slap in the face and it is I feel like I got bitch slapped. I really did. I got Sweet Home Alabama bitch slapped. But you know what? It is what it is. Because the true ending is that none of those scenarios happen. And I guess this is real life. We're alone. That's what this true ending is called. Because that's the achievement that I got. It says that we're alone. So we don't have a wife. We don't have a kid. We didn't kill anybody. There's no cop coming after us. And I think that fact is pretty depressing. The fact that we are alone and none of those things happen is good because he was actually with his sister, which is pretty damn stupid. But the fact that he's alone, that's a very sad ending. This ending wasn't a happy one, but it does make you think, like I said. So I want to see what you all thought about this in the comments below. The only reason why I played this is because a lot of you, I think probably 90% of the comments told me to go back and you guys gave me some hints and tips. And I was like, all right, I'm going to do it for you. I'm going to do it for the gang. And damn, what a freaking twist. But yeah, thank you all so much for the support of this mini 12-minute series. Let me know which ending you thought was the best one. Let me know if I missed anything. Let me know if there was an ending that was better than any of the ones that I got that you personally enjoyed and wanted me to see. But hopefully you all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.